Welcome to this channel. In this video, I will show you how to add a profile picture in your webmail or cPanel business email address. So as you can see, this is my business email address info at my url.com. So um, if I send or if I send a message to someone and they receive it, it does not come with my uh, business profile picture because there is no typical, there's typically, there's no setting in um, the webmail settings to be able to change the profile picture. So let me show you something. I've just sent a message to my personal Gmail address and then I received a message. So you see how it looks like. You just see a, 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 a blank, an email without a profile picture on it. And it looks suspicious because when people receive an email like this, they'll be suspecting that it is a scam. So you need to have a profile picture on it. Okay. So in order to have profile picture, you need to get a Gmail address. You have to add the process of doing it is to link it with a Gmail address as an alternate email so that it will take the picture of that particular Gmail address. Let me show you the step-by-step -step process of doing it. Okay. So I'm going to copy my Gmail address. Okay. Then I already have a Gmail address for my business, but that is not professional though, but this is a Gmail address for my business. It has my business um, logo. So in order to let my, bus my business email have this logo, this is what I have to do. You come to your Google account and you go to, you see manage account. So you click on manage account. Then you come to personal info. Scroll down, when you go to personal info, you will see um, contact info. So you click on that. And then you see Gmail account, then you see contact email and you see alternate emails, alternate emails. So you click on add alternate email. You'll be asked to confirm that you are the one actually authorizing this. So you put your password and log in. So after it logs in, it will ask you to now put the alternate email. So I'll put the ultimate email, alternate email, and then I'll click on add. Now it says a verification was sent to my business email. I should go there and verify. So I'm going to my business email inbox. So this is my business email inbox. Yet waiting for the message to arrive. So the message has arrived. So I'll just click on it. It opens and says a request was made to add this email to your Google account. Click here to verify this request. So I just click on net. So it verifies. So it has been verified. Like I say, your alternate email is now verified. Now, um, let me send an email. I'm going to now send an email and to a different email and see how it will appear. So let me show you. So I'll go to compose, then. So it's sent successfully. This is it. So after I refresh it, you see, it has just come with the business logo now. So you see that the logo is showing boldly on it. So if you follow this, you'll be able to um, change the profile picture of your email address um, or you to add a profile picture of your business in email address in the web mail or um, this is round cube um, web mail interface. Thank you for watching. Remember to subscribe to this channel, turn on the notification bell and like this video. I have done two videos earlier and they are all in the description of this video. One of it is how to create a professional email address and the second one is how to set up email forwarding to your email address. So like, let's say you have a professional email address like this. You want to set it up in such a way that any message that comes to your professional email can be forwarded to your Gmail address so that you can easily manage to reply messages or send messages from it. Thank you and see you in the next video.
Leave your comments in the comment section if you have any problem. Bye-bye.